good, so we good. They wouldn't do what I did it myself, now we good. Now we good. Sorry, my nigga can't buy what you sell and we good. Sorry, my nigga. Zuma TV, what's going on with y'all, man? I'm back with some more boxing, Philly boxing to be specific, you know what I'm saying? And I'm here to talk about the situation that's been going on with Tevin Farmer. Um, the trials that he had been going through by the, these bum-ass judges in boxing, you know what I'm saying? Um, if y'all don't follow Tevin Farmer, he had just fought some guy from Japan, Ogawa, you know what I'm saying? They fought for the vacant IBF strap that uh, Tank had. Tank missed weight. Tank, who, did, who, did, who was the last boy? Tank fought that, that undefeated nobody on uh, Mayweather McGregor undercard. He didn't make weight, so they vacated his, I mean, they uh, stripped him from his belt. You know, the IBF don't play that shit. Shout out to the IBF. Great move. You know what I'm saying? So uh, he vacates his strap, so the strap is open at 130 pounds. And um, Tevin Farmer steps up and said, I'll fight anybody for that vacant strap. So he goes and he fights Ogawa and uh, outboxes him. Straight, beautiful boxing by Tevin Farmer. The man, he, the man was missing all night. Tevin Farmer was countering. He was doing whatever the fuck he wanted in that ring. Did whatever he wanted. Whatever, whatever he wanted to do, he took over. You know what I'm saying? Slipping, slipping, rolling under punches, countering beautifully, boxing, moving, showing great boxing IQ, using the whole ring. Everything you would want out of a out of a fighter, he did that night. You know what I'm saying? I don't think he was able to hurt Ogawa from what I've seen, but it doesn't matter because they went 12 rounds and Ogawa got smoked on my scorecard at least. And come to find out, Tabitha Farmer gets robbed, blatantly robbed. Bullshit-ass scorecards. Those judges should not be able to judge another championship fight again. They need to go uh, judge some big man competitions or something or like some motherfucking uh, celebrity boxing matches because that shit was some corny shit going on over there. So, um... <clears throat> Tevin Farmer gets robbed, you know, and a lot of people are upset about this. A lot of people, as they should be, very, 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 very controversial uh, decision. So come to find out with the judges, and, and I think, and it was crazy, it was real coincidental that this fight happened in Vegas and that uh, Mayweather Promotions is based out of Vegas and uh, Tevin Farmer is from Mayweather Promotions. And uh, they don't want to fight Tevin Farmer, from what I understand. And Ogawa gets a controversial decision, and then it seems as if overnight that Tank was going to go to Japan to fight Ogawa just so suddenly that this fight did, had come into place. But all of that shit had backfired. Karma is a bitch. It backfired. And what happened was Ogawa popped dirty. That motherfucker was on some kind of performance enhancement drug. Karma is a bitch, ain't it? All that 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 fuckery y'all just did to Tevin Farmer, y'all try try to blow him out the water and make him look bad on paper. You know what I'm saying? And they talking about oh he got five losses now. Well guess what, bitch? According to boxing scene, according to motherfucking boxing scene, they ruled it a no contest after he had tested positive for steroids. Ogawa being the one who tests dirty. Not seven, Ogawa. So they they counted it as a no contest, as they should. And honestly, in my personal opinion, they need to switch that no contest to a motherfucking victory because Tevin Farmer cooked that nigga. I don't give a fuck what nobody said. He baked his ass. So that's what happened. Um, so there's a no contest. So now Tevin Farmer is in line to face Billy Dib for the title once again. Billy Dib, you in the fucking way, dog. Philly need a world champion. We don't got a world champion right now, man. Danny Garcia lost to Keith Thurman. You know what I'm saying? That was the only champion we had. The only world champion that I know of. If, if there's another, there ain't no Philly world champion. I know that for a fact. There ain't no world champion in Philly right now. So, you know what I'm saying? Philly need a new champion. Billy Dib, you in the motherfucking way, straight up. You know what I'm saying? I don't think you fucking with Tevin anyway. I think you gonna get, you gonna get big. You gonna get big just like Ogawa, and. Uh, Hopefully this this shit all comes into fruition, you know, make this fight happen so Philly can have a new world champion. Tevin Farmer, stay strong, my brother. You know what I'm saying? Stay strong. Um, keep 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 working hard. You know what I'm saying? I don't gotta tell you this. I don't gotta tell you this at all. You know what I'm saying? I met you on several occasions. Um, keep keep doing your thing, man. Beautiful. I love how karma just comes into play, man. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, congratulations to Tevin Farmer on another opportunity, even though he shouldn't even have to go through this shit again. 
They should just send the motherfucker IVF strap to this nigga address. That's just how I personally feel. But um, let me know what y'all think. What's y'all thoughts on Billy Dib? Tell me, Farmer, leave the comments below. I appreciate all of y'all. This is Mazuma TV, and I'm out.